Hi guys and welcome back to another cool episode of Toy Hunter. Yes, it's cool because we've got Harley Quinn in the house. Of course, from the Suicide Squad wave by uh, McFarlane Toys. It comes with the uh, build a figure King Shark. Okay, so let's take the standard procedure of inspecting this action figure comes with the box okay the very lovely Margot Robbie okay okay this uh this is the first of the four uh, suicide squad which I'll be unboxing and, and reviewing for you guys okay okay there's the box with the uh, suicide squad on it okay sit back and relax okay so now that we've opened Harley Quinn we're gonna be taking an in-depth look on, at this uh, action figure okay this uh, very lovely action figure okay? okay now guys so she only came with a staff and a uh, figure stand for this uh, Harley Quinn figure. Okay, now let's take an in the look at her face. Oh, luckily, we've got a Margot Robbie look like for this uh, action figure. So, Marlene um, has done a great job. Okay, she looks kind of Margot Robbie. Okay, so gonna be taking an in the plug okay, okay the face okay it comes with the uh, I think that's a heart tattoo on her cheeks okay and so she has so many tattoos on on her body okay that's the uh, figure stand that I'm talking about now oh let's take a closer look at this tattoo of uh, Harley Quinn okay Oh, it's upside down. You know, it upside down. Oh, it's the Joker and pudding, pudding cups. Okay, so there are lots of uh, numbers there, Roman numbers. So I don't know if that is how uh, many person that Harley Quinn killed. Okay, uh, let's take a look at the boots. Okay, very nice boots for her. And let's see if she's wearing any panties. Okay, she got a red panty on. Okay, her arms. Uh, I think this some look, um, looks like an Indian tattoo or an Aztec tattoo. Okay, I'm not very particular in that design. So, if you know her tattoo, comment down below, guys. Okay. And another tattoo. Okay, I think that's a snake or cannot distinguish it oh the letter J which stands of course we know that it stands for the Joker okay oh, very nice paint for this uh, McFarlane figure loving this figure and she got this uh, too small daddy monster is this daddy's mistress or daddy's monster Cannot uh, read further, so if you know this guy, uh, this that oh, it's I think it's mistress or monstrous. Oh, mistress or monster. Okay, so comment down below of what you guys think that stands for that is monster or that is mistress. Oh, she got another tattoo at the back. Okay, so this one, another Joker tattoo property of the Joker okay oh what's that letter N O C I think guys know what that does mean what it means so just comment down below okay so they this Harley Quinn is a okay I kind of like it very nice she can stand on her own the hands doesn't have an alternate hands okay that's 
Philippines and even have an alternate head course which is not common for the McFarlane uh, toys figure so that's uh, that's one thing that I hate about McFarlane toys game. no alternate head if they do have an alternate head you're gonna buy be you're gonna be buying another action figure okay let's spread her wings wingspan okay I mean so kind of having a hard time uh, spreading her uh, left arm okay but okay there is there he goes this is how far she goes okay wait what happened to my camera okay okay and her legs okay she can only extend it to this because uh the clothes is uh controlling it the spread of legs okay So that's it guys, that's the in depth look for this uh, Harley Quinn figure. Okay, this is the step, okay, not much of a design but still uh, very detailed, okay. As you can see, you no, know, not much of a design here. So it's just like a common step, okay. And now for my favorite part of my video, okay. The comparison so this is how tall Gal Gadot compared to Margot Robbie okay just don't know if in real life uh, Gal Gadot is taller than Margot Robbie okay. I just hope that uh, they make a Justice League which uh, were in the cast both Wonder Woman and Harley Quinn okay. love I would love uh, to see that movie okay. There she goes, okay, face to face with the Wonder Woman. And she, Harley Quinn stood on her ground. Okay. And so it's girl power for DC. Harley Quinn and Wonder Woman. Two powerful. Uh, women character DC and now let's have the bat see the Batman okay okay this bat scales well with this Harley Quinn uh, I don't know if uh, the bat black will be guessing on the upcoming su suicide squad I just hope that uh, we got a sneak peek at the bat black on the uh, upcoming suicide squad so this is how they look together okay now one thing's missing for McParley to do is Jared Leto's Joker okay I just hope they also make this uh, Jared Leto's Joker okay? in the upcoming days so my rating for this figure is a I think it's a 9 out of 10 for me okay I still do hope that McFarlane releases the uh, very first uh, Harley Quinn, the uh, famous Harley Quinn uh, costume from the first uh, Suicide Squad with her with her baseball bat, okay, with her shorts. Okay? I just hope that McFarlane releases that uh, action figure, okay. So it'll be a great one, okay. So it's an a nine for ten for me. So that's it guys, this is the first video for the King Shark uh, build a figure map with uh, Harley Quinn on it. So we still have three more, oh, stick around, stay tuned and don't forget to like and subscribe to my YouTube channel and as my saying go, let's the toy hunt begins, bye bye, more toys to open. So that's it guys, so thanks for watching, goodbye and ciao